uh, you know, on a beautiful Thursday, waking up to some beautiful people, but also plenty of sunshine. Now, the sunshine that we are seeing outdoors uh, this morning, I can assure you that it will fade behind those clouds uh, this morning. In addition to that, unfortunately, this afternoon, we will have some wet weather to contend with. Temperatures also taking a tumble, so noticeably cooler this afternoon from what we did get yesterday with all those 80s scattered across the map. Moving into Mother's Day weekend, we can look forward to not just a cool weekend, but also some unsettled uh, weather patterns we're looking at the possibility of some showers moving across the area we are shower free this morning we do have temps in the 50s and 60s across the tri-state this is what our radar and satellite are looking like this morning pretty nice and decent some yeah we do have some clouds out there but moisture doesn't sit too far away now as we take a look we do have a front sitting across areas south of us so keeping a lot of that moisture at bay but again this low pressure system enough to drive in that wet weather they're getting into our afternoon hours. So take a look at our not just temperatures, but also our precipitation starting off this morning dry in the 60s around lunchtime. We'll see those temperatures jump uh, up into at least the upper 60s across the city, but still dry out there for lunch. It's when we get to our later afternoon hours that our temperatures still in the 60s, but you'll notice that wave of moisture building in it. It is expected to be here during our overnight hours. In fact, picking up moving into tomorrow morning temperatures dropping right back down into the 50s and tomorrow afternoon and evening also do look to be a wet for us here across the tri-state that wet energy expected to last across our Mother's Day weekend, but also you'll notice another dip in those temperatures still in the 50s for tomorrow, but into the 60s by Mother's Day weekend. The good news in all of this is that we do dry out by the start of next week, but also temperatures jumping back up into the 70s. Alex.